Hi guys, finally I am back again. I was thinking to make a new video for a long time, but I couldn't. But this is the best Rotohana video, I assure you. Because I was, when I am in Hawaii, I was trying to find uh, uh, Rotohana videos and like I couldn't find so the helpful video. So this is why I wanted to do this because the Rotohana is the, I think the, the one of the best part maybe the best part of Maui Maui Island in Hawaii so I will give you tips and I will show you some pictures and like you will know everything about Rotohana it was my favorite but uh, you should you should be careful about the tours and everything and where you should stop because I spent meaningless money so uh, I don't want you to uh, experience that so no worries I'm starting now I will show uh, first where I am uh, I am now I'm in Istanbul actually it's the Jeff's journal and I was thinking to um, uh, take more video for USA but I had a problem with my visa and I am in here Istanbul Turkey, uh, Turkey for a while so I'm also sorry for my half English let's start it so I want to start my video with beautiful Istanbul view this is where I am recording my Rotohana video for you guys so I would like to put the uh, back view of this view but sun is coming from other side so it's not possible at least you can see so first thing first um, my my some friends in I was in San Diego I was going to uh, from LA the the Hawaii Maui so my some friends uh, recommend me to go road to Hana with the tours but we were thinking to do that but the last minute like some um, friend told us a application for Rod Johanna actually so helpful I will uh, show you that so I think my my opinion opinion is you shouldn't do tours because like I saw the tour ca cars and I don't think so that comfortable actually they are good cars but they're not very small but again I was seeing the people who is stopping and like the looking the view or like you have to wait everybody maybe it's it's gonna be not so meaningful stop for you but the other people will want to stay so long then you are gonna go crazy so and the thing was why my friends recommend me that for like I was going with my boyfriend and like if he drives he is not gonna see the view because the road to Hana is not the destination actually you will hear this the road to Hana is the road is like the in rainforest and oh my god it's so beautiful so like uh, and it's like go going back and forward so if you are two somebody can drive the when you are uh, the start and the back way uh, you can switch the uh, driving so I think it makes sense if you start very early so you will uh, see the around the your friend uh, the second person will see around the also the daytime is important so the first thing don't do tour I think rent a car and the second thing this application so this is the application gypsy gypsy guide here so I will click on it so this is what you should Maui so I got the I think all Maui one that uh, there is two application one of them seven dollar one of them ten dollar I think this is the ten dollar one there is one application but this gypsy guide is just road to Hana and one of them is like all Maui is like it's also showing I think the volcanoes and everything so this is very helpful you should do this because the you can connect the car with Bluetooth and it's gonna tell all the stories also about road to Hana and uh, 
every stops, everything, the history about Maui, Hawaii, everything. So it was very actually fun to listen. And I have to say, like, I think I have the most asymmetric face ever. Actually, it's not that much, but you know, this camera is showing so weird. I want to fix myself. <laughs> so, okay, whatever. So, um, first you are the, the, uh, downloading this application and you are starting uh, from the closed airport. It's going to show everything, the all locations, and it's going to tell some story or where you should go. Every stop is working with GPS perfectly and the maps. So uh, you are going to save. So first you start, um, you will see whole greens. I am putting some pictures now and the videos. So this is the first stop the Twin Falls, Twin Falls I guess, I forgot the name but it was so beautiful bamboo trees and perfect nature. After the Twin Falls, we started to go back to uh, road, like you see, it's so beautiful. I cannot even stay in car more than two hours, but uh, it was 12 hours total and I was so peaceful and happy, like so beautiful. All oh. the road okay. is the green and peaceful and it was even raining I and I will recommend something about the weather and the time you can go to Hawaii but it was beautiful so also I'm gonna tell something about uh, I think it was second stop it will say Garden of Eden don't go Garden of Eden I'm gonna tell why this is also the from Garden of Eden a video It's nice birds and uh, uh, animals but the thing is, it's so important. <laughs> I went there for rainbow trees. So rainbow trees is so beautiful. This is again from Garden of Eden. Um, but you don't need to pay uh, for seeing these rainbow tre trees $15 per person. Because look how much I love this rainbow trees. It was my favorite. And I, for taking many pictures, I paid 15 bucks, but it's actually free. So, so yeah, like I said, the Garden of Eden, I wanted to say more here because it's like $15 per person. So we paid uh, for two 30 bucks. And it was saying like it's 200 uh, the plants and everything and blah blah and just I, I my only purpose was the seeing the, the rainbow trees and I was thinking it's like many of them there and I can take pictures because so beautiful I will put the picture now but uh, it was very small area and you are paying uh, I think it, a huge money for nature is that the just nature and the next stop this is the thing also like the if if you, even you download the application Rotohana uh, he is saying there uh, Garden of Eden beautiful but he's not saying actually he always says the tour guide the, the where is with fee where is without fee but uh, the only thing about the application I'm not happy about it he should have said this is the uh, uh, the fee and we don't need to pay that. I was thinking I'm not gonna see the rainbow tree afterwards, but the next stop was the the and the abertorum, I guess. I don't know the pronunciation, but it's the free area that you can see the rainbow trees and like very beautiful is nature. I'm just adding the pictures now. And one more thing, don't take videos vertical if you are thinking to do YouTube video <laughs> sorry guys so look at these rainbow trees of course I use some the Photoshop for this <laughs> the colors are more colorful but it was so beautiful so 
and this is the normal without the Photoshop, the colors. And you will see what I mean. Look, these beauties, like not just the rainbow trees, everything was uh, different trees and the nature and so beautiful what can i say and i might be obsessed about rainbow trees the many video but i want to show you you can really get many many good pictures and not just the rainbow trees and so it was our third stop and after this we went some the black sand beach and this is the church uh close to the that Lake Sand Beach, it was cool and that the, some graves and the, the inside of the church and it was, there was a very good banana bread, you have to buy that. So after this part, um, get the banana bread, it was so delicious. So and also the, at Rotohana there is not, not many uh, stops and, uh, for food. Actually we went I think Monday. So Monday, many places was the closed, so you should search about it. I The road was more calm, but um, yeah, we had to wait for eating like, like four hours, something. So after this church and the, um, the blacks and the black rocks, and it was cool in the place, and all the way we stopped like many falls like i will show that many different falls i will put a few video sorry again for their being vertical <laughs> not never gonna do that again so uh, after falls and so important tip so this application this the the uh, gypsy guide doesn't uh, give the red the red sand page so beach <laughs> so my friend told me before it was the most beautiful beach he he had ever seen he has ever seen so ugh, my grammar whatever so uh, and it, you cannot even see in, uh, on the map actually you should like the uh make zoom and you should go with map this part not with the the gypsy guide because you cannot find the red sandwich and don't skip that don't pass that i will put some pictures and videos like so beautiful so while you are going to red sand beach it's you, you are gonna see like the trees and like there is no road or like path for going there then you are gonna think like we are at the wrong place my boyfriend started to say no there is no way and it was like between the trees very small path and it's writing as dangerous don't go etc but actually that is the road so you for find the the hidden heaven the red sand beach you have to uh follow that the path the small but it's like a kind of dangerous it's like because it's so tight and the, uh, uh, under it's the kind of high and uh, the rocks but go for it uh richard <laughs> lost his slippers with one barefoot <laughs> he came my poor baby but he, he always says it 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 was worth so i am putting some a, a picture about red sand beach too uh sorry for if i'm saying like beach i am trying to say beach okay I'm just getting wet for this, so I will pay. You got a whole tour watching you. Say hi to my burros, my little baby. He's not leaving me alone now. So like I said, these ones, it's small to fall. The first, uh, the two videos was the falls, and the next ones after now the red sandwich videos. Be careful! The trail is dangerous, but we wanna still do red sandwich. Oh. <laughs> okay. It's so dangerous. So dangerous. We are trying to find. Hi, beauty, heaven, red sand beach. <laughs> I, I fell one time. 
and I don't think you could swim in here. <laughs> oh. So this is a beautiful red sand beach and the I, I don't know why I kept saying the dangerous danger I was just joking actually it's not that dangerous road it's a bit you should be just careful so you can take good pictures with your love at the red sand beach and after red sand beach so after red sand beach again I forgot to tell like just before Red Sand Beach you are gonna find a place for it like it's gonna be like small shops already for like the fresh uh, pineapple and the, the banana or smoothies the natural uh, organic smoothies and they are like small shops and also just like after three four hours later it was another shop but it was closed because it was monday i'm sure i checked also and no worries after that the left side you are gonna find i forgot the name but you are gonna find no worries it's, there is place to eat food like there it was the tacos and uh, the pork and the uh, fish and chips and mac and cheese and and the pizza so many plays like the, together and there is some gift shops so this is also from road to hana a whale tale because uh we watched the whale uh we went to whale watching so it's so good the stones the beautiful stones you can buy some uh gifts to your family friends or yourself for memories so after this food uh, stop already the red sand beach after red sand beach also another like a small place for like thai i think thai food and like the again pizza and uh, it will be left side it's almost the uh, end and the uh, road to hana hana road after this there is seven um seven heaven pools what was the thing sacred sacred pools so i'm checking now the name and i am putting the last stop is also the the entrance is free uh, not free fee there is a fee for entrance uh, and it closes the just the before the six i guess it it should be five but we were so late so <laughs> this is our thing the back way it was dark for us because we started the road so late you shouldn't do that you should wake up at like 6 7 a.m and go the the, the start to driving mm, what else i'm gonna say so like i said the road to hana is like more than the stops is like so beautiful to seeing uh, the forest and all green and nature so we went to um road to the we went to hawaii at december so i think you shouldn't go at december <laughs> yeah we were thinking it's gonna be sunny it's not every time it's happening but it was like four or five days we were dreaming about it too much it's my first hawaii the vacation and it was raining all the time i couldn't go 10 i could i couldn't swim it's like uh one time i guess at lahanya uh, La, La lahanya La <laughs> i should have to, took this video taking this video way before i am almost forgetting so and um I think you shouldn't take risk maybe the March is is better but December it was raining but even though it's raining I really enjoy road to Hana even it's raining you saw already my <laughs> videos under the rain so there the road to Hana is must must and must like one of the most beautiful the 
the vacation or trip I ever had, the road to Hana, is I cannot even forget about. So after Red Sand Beach, again another fall, and it was one of the best, I think. It was very cool. And after this, we have just one more stop, and I looked at Seven Sacred Pools, and this is still the fall. I like this fall a lot. So after this, we will see the Seven Sacred Pools. It's coming, and yeah, this is the last stop. It was beautiful, but the before I read, people were swimming here than a guy and his kids that uh, died here, so they just forbid that. Oh, I'm so tired. I don't know if it's. Uh... Yeah, so like you hear, I was so tired. It was a very nice bridge. It's good pictures there. So I was almost not going the Seven Sacred Pools, but we finished everything. So windy, it's crazy, but the world to see. So Rotahana is ended. So it's tiring, man. As you can notice, my English went bad. Uh, the reason <laughs> because it, when I'm tired my English is going worse so what else I'm gonna say is not just road to Hana at Maui also if you have any questions I can answer that question so I can make new videos for that uh, we wanted to go to Volcano so much is like you, the, you are watching the sunrise they recommend the sunrise above the clouds is the, the mountain and it's like volcan volcanoes and we couldn't make it the next day uh, we were going to fly fly back to uh, LA so uh, it was 12 hours total but it was totally worth and like I was even not complaining after 12 hours in the car and I will definitely go there again if I would go to Maui again you should do this it will work I, I promise so um, sorry my the half English lately and I'm gonna make more video about uh, California about San Diego mostly just um, I wish I could co continue my the travels, but I stopped for now. So, but I'm thinking uh, if you ask me anything, I can make new videos because about San Diego, I know so like almost every trail, the hiking spots and sunset spots, the everything. So, hope to see you soon and what else you can also the uh, follow me on my instagram mm, so you just call me jev because my normal name is so hard for the english pronunciation so i think uh, i will add my instagram page here also there is a hawaii stories album so you can the see the more of than uh, more of uh, more of than this Oh my god, I think I should stop <laughs> in there. So, I wanna promise I will take new video very soon. It's taking so long, my videos, but I think I'm starting now. So, see you soon, guys.